I woke up this morning and it was a regular morning, regular time. You know, the time changed recently, the daylight saving, so it's darker in the morning. And so I woke up, regular, regular schedule because I'm, I keep to the same habits all the time, which is what I'm always talking about in the book. And I uh, started to do my journaling and it was raining outside. And I, I immediately got this feeling of, maybe I'll skip my workout today and just go directly into writing because I'm working on a new fitness program. And I played around with this thought of skipping my Friday workout for about an hour. I had my oatmeal, I had another cup of coffee, I had to upload something on the internet and it was taking a little bit longer and I was playing around with this thought that I'll just stay here and just work and skip this workout. One of the things that I talk about in the book is one of your habits, which is to advance schedule your workouts. I have a workout scheduled for Friday. It is a heavy weight training workout. It's the heaviest one that I do throughout the week. It's the heaviest one, it's on Friday, so it's shorter. And then I do a longer session of yoga to relax. And it's advanced scheduled because of this problem. Your head, your mind is going to try to negotiate with you. It's going to try to tell you that there's something else more important to do. And all it's doing is avoiding, it's trying to avoid boredom. It's, it's trying to avoid a pain because it's perceived pain that my workout's gonna hurt. And it's also lazy. Your, there is an aspect of your mind, one of the archetypes within our minds, that is actually lazy. It doesn't want to necessarily exert effort. So if there's a way to minimize that, move less, sit still, um, put things off that, that are going to tax or that it perceives it's going to tax the body or the mind or the spirit in some way, your mind, there's an aspect of your mind that will try to talk you out of it. So you have to advance schedule your workouts and your food and then keep the schedule because here I am, I just finished exercising and I literally, my workouts are 45 minutes to one hour. I do not stay longer. And it was amazing. And it wasn't amazing until about 10 minutes in. It took that long. And when I got to the last set of my legs, I did very heavy at the end, it was like, it, it, it was like, I, I just like happiness surging through my body. And I, you know, you don't remember that in the morning when you wake up and it's time for your workout and you're like, oh, there's something else I could do. You won't remember that. So you just have to keep your advance scheduled plan. Keep it, don't change it, no matter what that little gnome in your head tries to tell you.